I was not expecting this to be this good. An Arc Demon's Dilemma. How to love your elf bride. <laughs> yes, this is the title of the anime. This is a comedy romance fantasy anime by Brains Base. The studio behind Defrag, Inspector, Spice and Wolf second season, and To Your Eternity. I went into this anime thinking that it would be meh just like usual everyday adventure let's go collect waifus or something and nope i mean technically it's not wrong <laughs> but it's the good kind of not wrong it has a great concept of like this dude being the ultimate simp his life is probably just like a discord okay no discord mods are demons wait i just said it's an arc demon okay never mind he is basically isolated from society <laughs> He knows no one other than his overpowered friend, which by the way, he is also overpowered. And yeah, he's, uh, he's not probably the best person when it comes to delivery when he's speaking. <laughs> he might think something and say something entirely different, or in a way different way that he intended. Also, this guy's friend tells him about like an auction or something, and then they go there, and the one being in the auction is this elf. And when they showed her, the main character, well, he discovered what a boner is. Yes, it was a glorious moment. And yeah, so basically he bought her with one million whatever currency they're doing. <laughs> and she cannot stop about thinking that he's gonna kill her. Even when he tells her he's not gonna kill her, she's like, Oh, are you like gonna hang me or something? <laughs> or cut my head in a guillotine? And yeah, the story is, it is funny, to say the least. And it was so good that I couldn't be patient. And after finishing episode 1, I didn't make this video. I, I, I watched episode 2 too. <laughs> It was just that good. And by the way, by the making of this video, there's also episode 3. And uh, believe me, it took a lot of willpower to not watch it before doing this. The characters are really great. Mainly like the main two. And yeah, we have a new elf to the collection. And I think that enemies that take a certain character which has given up on life. And basically slowly reshape their lives to probably one of the best lives they could ever have. These enemies will always be appreciated. No matter how variations we see, people will always appreciate these kind of enemies. Because you can just chill and be happy. And and yep, I really recommend everyone to watch this anime. It is really damn entertaining. It plays with your heartstrings in a good way. That's about it. I'm literally about to press the button to start the new episode. And yes, uh, get the fuck out.